Have you ever pondered about the common misconceptions about black history? It's a question many of us fail to ask ourselves, despite its profound implications. A prevailing fallacy, for instance, is that black history begins with slavery, a misconception that grossly undermines the rich and diverse ancestry of black individuals. To challenge these inaccuracies and shed light on the truth, Dr. Claude Anderson penned Dirty Little Secrets About Black History, Its Heroes, and Other Troublemakers. Published in 1997, this national bestseller presented an alternative perspective, revealing the hidden history of black folks within the broader historical narrative. Dr. Anderson's research delved into the often overlooked contributions and presence of black individuals throughout history, particularly in the Americas. His work is not merely a book, it's a revolutionary exploration that challenges the status quo, demanding recognition for the significant role of black people in shaping our world. Dr. Anderson's book is a revolutionary work that uncovers the often overlooked contributions and presence of black individuals in history, particularly in the Americas. Did you know that before the arrival of the so-called Native Americans, the Americas were populated by a black population known as the Clovis Folsom? Quite a revelation, isn't it? According to Dr. Claude Anderson, in his groundbreaking book, this black population roamed the southwestern United States a staggering 10 to 15,000 years ago. Unearthed archaeological findings lend credence to this theory. Tools, artifacts, and remnants of ancient settlements paint a vivid picture of a civilization that thrived long before the arrival of the groups we've traditionally labeled as Native Americans. The implications of this are profound and potentially game-changing. If we accept these findings as historically accurate, it challenges our whole understanding of who the first Americans truly were. We're not talking about a minor adjustment here, but a seismic shift in our perception of American history. The Clovis Folsom people of African origin were here thousands of years before the ancestors of modern-day American Indians crossed the Bering Straits onto the North American continent. This timeline, according to Dr. Anderson, places the Clovis Folsom as the oldest traceable population group on the North American continent. And what does this mean for the term Native American? Well, it calls into question its very validity. If the ancestors of today's American Indians arrived five to 6,000 years ago, then they were not the original inhabitants of these lands. They were newcomers, immigrants, just like the European settlers who would come thousands of years later. It's a fascinating thought, isn't it? That the true first Americans were not the ones we've been taught about in our history books, but a group of African blacks who established communities lived and thrived in what is now the southwestern United States. If Dr. Anderson's findings hold true, it could mean that the history of the Americas as we know it might need a significant rewrite. But then again, history is always evolving, always revealing new truths, and who knows what other secrets are waiting to be uncovered. But what impact did the Folsom people have on the Americas and its later inhabitants? Let's delve into that. The Folsom people of African descent left an indelible mark on the Americas. Their presence, dating back between 10 to 15,000 years, predates the arrival of the Asians across the Bering Strait by several millennia. This timeline opens up the possibility of interbreeding between these early Africans and the later arriving Asians. Could it be this mingling of lineages that contributed to the physical characteristics of the early American Indians, who bore neither distinct Asian features nor yellow skin coloring? Furthermore, the legacy of the Folsom people is echoed in the numerous monuments depicting gods with Negroid features found throughout North, Central, and South America. These artifacts, coupled with historical accounts of black-skinned people in South America, suggest a significant African presence in the Americas long before Columbus set foot on these shores. The story of the Folsom people, as told by Dr. Anderson, challenges us to rethink the narrative of American history and the role of black individuals within it. In the short span of this video, we've delved into some of the dirty little secrets about black history that Dr. Anderson reveals in his book. We've explored the common misconceptions, unearthing the truth about the first Americans, a truth that is often buried in the sands of time. If this glimpse into a world lost to time has captured your imagination, smash that like button, and don't forget to subscribe for more adventures into the unknown. Lastly, for more information about the names and subjects mentioned in this video, get your copy of the Amazon best-selling book series, 19 White Men, who admitted there were indigenous black people in the Americas, and 13 black scholars, who admitted there were black people in the Americas before Columbus by Chase McGee. Link in the description. Stay curious and keep exploring.